then you attract what you are and you you're not attracting what you want because you are a product of your environment yeah you are yeah. for me um i've always understood that you you know if a flower doesn't flourish in a room like is it the is it the flower's fault mm. that no every flower is meant to bloom so it's just an environment um my favorite biologist bruce lipton is is huge on talking about the environment um like you know affecting the cells and that like we really are just a cell so I, I like to always make sure, and I've done this forever, uh, obviously didn't have the best upbringing, so I would look to a different environment. I always made sure I wasn't like the smartest person in the room. I like to be in rooms where people were either mechanically like-minded or in a, a different intelligence. Like I really enjoy making sure that I've always been in a room where I was like, good, this is who I, because f- I know who I am. Like deep down, I know who I am and I know where I'm going. Mm-hmm. And although I never thought that it would come to being the all-star defense, like best tackler in the world or getting to model in America or getting to be in magazine, I didn't I didn't set out to go, that's my plan. But those things came because of that's obviously that's who I am. You know? And then you so, kind of just run, roll with the punches. And I just punches. flow with it. So mm-hmm. I think you need, I always have goals and I'm always working towards something. But I also know that certain things are like, and I'm like, oh. And it sticks to you. and Let's do it. Mm. Excellent. Thank you, universe. You know, like mm. um, maybe that's my gypsy airhead side or that's my lucky side, you know. But, I, yeah, I so guess. So are you, are you spiritual? Are you, uh, do you believe in astrology, things like this? I right. think, I honestly, I believe in everything. Like, I think I'm so science-based that I can't. There's certain things where I can have tears down my face being like, why is this happening? This is weird. Like, mm-hmm. it's, oh, it's ghost surreal. I don't know. Like, but to me, energy is real and there's something in the intangible. And that, you can't describe that to someone where you're like, can you feel that? And they're like, what? And you're like, okay, whatever. But if I always followed those feelings, whether it's towards a person or a gym or like, going and moving to America or, or just committing and being like, I'm leaving my hometown and I'm going to Cairns. I didn't think I was going to run my own electrical contracting business, you know, but it took that move to go there, f- lose 2000 jobs. And then I was like, just working out a way, working, like figuring out the puzzle and then boom. Oh, are, are you very analytical before making a decision or a, a leap? Or do you kind of get a gut feeling and go with it? I think I'm a gut. I have a gut feeling. I'm also, I have to process a lot. So I have to think about, I have to have as much information as well. But I also know that, hell, there's been plane rides where I've just sat there. Like, I think I was meant to go out to the mines um, up in Mount Isa or it was somewhere up north. And that's when I was like, I got to get off this plane. I got to get off this plane right now. Mm. And then I did that in Brisbane. And then I stayed in Brisbane for, for whatever reason. And, you know, then from there, I became a thermographer and got into the LFL. If I never got off that plane, I'd probably still be in the You're mines. on route to the mine. So maybe that's something you, you I, I don't want to say failed at, but at least realized quick and yeah. gave up on it because it didn't feel right. There you go. Yeah, there's the answer. We got it. <laughs> so what's that commitment issue? Yeah, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, no but no, you get me? No. You, you had, you had the, the, the gut feeling that it yeah, wasn't of right. And, it wasn't and you, right, And you made though. the right decision, right? Yeah. yeah. In the end, even if you think it's wrong, it's always right. Like, mm. you're never actually doing anything wrong. It's just leading you. As long as you're being true to yourself, you know, like... Like being true to yourself, it's never leading you astray. It's never leading you off a path. Even when things are just like, holy moly, everything's on fire. Mm. Like it's, it's okay. 